welcome back uh i thought i had already started the recording for youtube and i didn't we've just left the tower that you would have left off in uh we are on our way to carry on with the hags missions we i just teleported here because i i didn't know where else to go frankly and notice that we were right by the murder target here who you've already spoken to and he still doesn't i'll try talking to him again but i think he severely doesn't care uh, do you really not care make haste i have a very busy day of very demanding yeah he really doesn't care anything and the best you'll find in boulder's gate a certain ineffable qu very good ma'am all right well i don't know money you sell money all right I remember fashion's a fickle mistress so be sure to return okay it's kind of annoying that we've spoken to him and he's still on the map but it just is what it is i guess the guy's the biggest c word oh dear oh dear oh dear my obs is so broken i don't know what's going on we need to we're gonna ignore that save vanra no it's kazador save murder, murder target save vanra yeah so let's do like a marker here and carry on like this way hi raisin how's it going lovely where's the nearest tavern i don't know but i like this holy shit it's like a ship ship themed that's brilliant oh my gosh oh my gosh oh you're drunk are you asleep drunk yeah drunk and unconscious living their best life clean take his kid his kidneys flowery shite shimmer of the amazing unpaid debt i think i'm doing them a favor gan it i've just had the worst night of my life yes worse than that time with the baron cult schult i don't know uh i'm in kalisham i decided to hit up the bar everyone goes out goes on about the copper tap you know the one that makes its own award-winning brews well i tried one tastes like flowers Tastes like flowers had a wank on my tongue. I've not backed 10 pints of ale since and I can still bloody taste it. Have a couple of barrels of your swill ready next time I dock. I think that piss you call booze is the only thing that will get this shite off my tongue. That's crazy, yo. And this is why I will never finish this game. I will never finish this game because this shit is too interesting you don't need you don't even need to walk past this mailbox in your playthroughs let alone interact with it and i can't not interact with this shit and it's genuinely interesting to me we're doomed guys we're so cooked i was tapped out and thought someone had chat and typed out that would frankly be incredibly bold so it tastes like a flower wanked in my mouth uh, Mr. Shimmer, I've been to every one of your shows, even though my dad says I'm too young for the Blushing Mermaid. It's a burlesque show. You're the best performer I've ever seen in my whole life. Could you please teach me how to dance? You won't have to do too much. You won't have... It's the wrong two. So this is obviously a young person. They don't know the difference between two and two. Uh, I'm already super good. I can do two cartwheels in a row. I'll help you do your makeup, wash your sparkly outfits, do your hair, whatever you need. I'll be the best student you ever had on Ilmata's word. I'll be at your show later. I'm the girl with blonde curly hair, which I think would look great with one of your blue ribbons in it. I'm just saying. Can't wait to get started. Lots of love, Mindy. But here's the question, right? That's not the right two. You won't have to do two. Oh, sorry. I miss. Wait, that's my fault. Small fault. Let me pause. Let me pause. Everyone, back away from the keyboard right now. I thought it said you won't have to do too much. You won't have to do. Yeah, I, I, I'm dyslexic. I, I thought it said you won't have to do too much. And I was like, it's wrong too. It's my fault. It's my fault. Back away. Back away. Un delete it. 
delete the paragraph that every, all of you have written right now. <laughs> then Brandon goes, too late, Dharma, too TWO. I know the difference between two, two, and two. I just thought it said it. You did, I too, I don't have to do too much. You know what the sad thing is? Because then I was about to say, we already know this is someone that's youngish because whoever, whoever it is, their dad thinks they're too young to be at the show. And so I was like, you know, it's fucking crazy how well uh, Larian has set it up so that um, they write they write stuff that feels appropriately the person's age. Because they've done that before where they have intentional typos and stuff. And I was like, oh, it's so clever. But that just wasn't one of those moments. Leave me alone. I delete it. Captain, I heard that bollocks Bruno Indomicus is working off a debt of at yours. He owes me a pretty penny on Baldur's Bone. On Baldur's Bone, excuse me, and I intend to collect. Tell him to send me one of his fingers, or best yet, do the deed yourself. I'll be checking the mailbox later. Better not be empty. Brinks. A different hand appears to be beneath the letter. Brinks. I ought to drown you in your own piss for such dramatics. Who do you think you are? Nine fingers? Try that shit with her. I dare you. As for Bruno, come find me at the maid. We'll settle his debt and add to his tab. No missing fingers needed. Bosun Gannett. Bosun? Bosun Gannett. Bosun Gannett. Um, wow, people are just laid out drunk here, dude. Oh, here's the entrance. Belly up to the bar. We have mead, beer, and wine. Gold won't quench your thirst. Get yourself a mug of joy. Lovely. Anti-hag support group poster. Grim, like, do I? You can just talk. Wondrous news. Baldur's Gate has a new duke. Gortash will do marvelously. Don't you think? I swear that guy sounds familiar. Chav, have you talked to Van Vanra's mum yet? I think I would have ages ago. Ages, ages, ages ago. Uh, don't quote me on it. How cool is this? But I think I did. Because she would have been the one that set me on the course to save Vanra. No piss in her shit. If you break it, you pay for it. Any fighting and Captain Grizzly has sank you. Got it? Oh, I'm here about the missing girl, Vanra. Guards above. Not again. You pull a knife on me like the last one and you're getting a boot, you hear? Who pulled a knife on you? That woman, Lara, Laura, whatever her bloody name is. She was screaming her head off about some kid. Tore the place apart. Oh, bloody disturbing. Captain Grizzly had a clocker in the end. Threw her out on her arse. Good riddance. You guys were talking about a West Country accent the other day in a different stream. There's your West Country accent, innit? If you're here for the music, look elsewhere. It's like listening to a cat being flogged up here. All right. Deary me. Seems like a good moment to talk. Unless the main. The captain is gonna belt the heads off these lads if they keep singing. Stick around. It's gonna be quite the show. Yeah, so we need that for five minutes, Java. Please and thank you. You're having a laugh. I can't do accents like that. It's just not in my skin. Now, this is the thing. There's supposed to be a great performer. I want to see this good performer. Slog. Do we talk about you? Word of advice, don't open a tab here. I didn't pay for 16 months and suddenly it's work off your debt or lose a limb. Not a bit of reason on them. Not at all. It's weirdly attractive. I I think that England has so, oops, that's what I meant to do. So many, Excuse you. Um, I think there's so many like beautiful accents that are warm and lovely and uh, I would put that up there. Can't a captain be bloody hung over in peace? Oh. 
Why, hello there. Captain Grizzly at your service. What can I do for a long drink of water like yourself? Steady on. I'm here about missing girl. Va Stay on track. Oh, not this claptrap again. Listen, Laura was here, all right? Knocking back pints like there's no tomorrow. But she was alone. I saw head nor ass of this so-called kid. And when we tried to kick her out, she pulled a knife on my front man. Bet she didn't tell you that bit, huh? If Laura's daughter isn't here, where is she? <sighs> not a notion. But not a soul has seen this so-called vanner of hers, myself included. Look, I know Laura from my pirating days. She ran with Bart Black Dagger's crew. Heard they tossed her overboard when she gutted the bosun over a game of cards. Now, I'd no beef with her before this. All are welcoming the maid. But threatening my staff, claiming we took her kid, she's bonkers. <laughs> Dangerous. Next time she pulls a knife on me and mine, someone might die. Something has to be done. All right. Uh... What are you suggesting? There's one way and one way only to shut someone up. You're trying to kill She's her. dangerous. And I couldn't call myself a captain if I stood by and did nothing. I hate that it's come to this. But I'll pay a hoard of gold to whoever scuppers her. Permanently. That's mental, that. That's insane. Before I do quench, thank you so much for using your prime here. Five months. Guess who's back? back again i need to meet some moon druid i'm thrilled that you're here lovely welcome welcome in how's it going um that's insane no less insane than lying about having a kid if you don't do it i'll find someone else oh you shit can make it painless not everyone will what if well don't take too long or someone else might get there before what you. if laura is the hag and she's trying desperately to find vanra not because vanra is her child but because she wants to um nom gobble gobble the plots are thickening gail looks horrified is he did he get disappointed in me gail gail should just be lucky to be here frankly is there something you want to talk about Give me a kiss. I'm all pointy ears, my love. Are you okay? Are you unwell? <laughs> there is nothing I'd like more. Please, new kiss. Please, new kiss. Please, new kiss. It's not the new kiss. What do I do, guys? What do I do? <sighs> I'm going to have to un uninstall the mods or something. <sighs> Perfect. Every time. But I can't look at me if it's not me. You know what I mean? You have to beat Kazador. I hope that's it. I really hope that that's it. Investigate, save Ranra, investigate the blushing mermaid. Is that really what I have to do? We spoke to Captain Grizzly, tells that Laura doesn't have a child, never did. She also claims Laura is a dangerous pirate who attacked her and her staff. The captain has asked us to kill Laura. Blushing Mermaid bartender tells that Laura was behaving strangely. She pulled a knife on him, the owner of the tavern. Had to throw her out. We, sh we should speak to Captain... Okay. Honey, creditors are clawing at our door. This marriage will save the business. Just meet the Nielsen son. One meeting for us, for your family. Excuse me, madam, quick question. Would you marry a stranger so your family can make buckets of gold? No. I don't know about marriage, but I'd meet with them at least. You can give them a chance. You might be able to have your cake and eat it too. Well, 
we'll just save in case. Yeah, it's not it, unfortunately. I need to uninstall the mods, right? See? I'll tell your mother to make arrangements. But, Dad. Not another word. You'll meet the Nielsen boy, and you're going to love him. I promise. But you have to honor, if she doesn't want to marry him, you have to honor that. Want to hear a hot one? The other day, I met some folks who banded together to fight back. Against what, you ask? Hags. How stupid can you get? And then I think we would have talked to everyone at this point. <clears throat> uh, a few dozen streamers ago, we go. A stream Sorry, so like that. Big fan of Duke Gortash. Turn your ass around and walk, preferably straight into the Arbor waters. All right. Um, there is a murder target here. What's their name? Nesha. Nesha. At the ready. Uh, you'd have to roll back to a save before the mods. Is that true or not, guys? Do we know? Which obviously was is not going to happen, if that is true. I don't know if we felt very convic convinced that that was the case. Wouldn't Nesha have to be somewhere here? And I already... Oh, Nesha. Nesha? Nesha! My friend dared me to come here alone for a couple of mugs of ale. So here I am. You just drank poison. Oh, no. She makes all scars to kill her on the loose and you're a target. Come on, mate. Who would want me dead? Honest. Then go on. If I point, must have mistaken. Please listen to me. Others have died already and you're in danger. Yes. I do. Time to die. Imagine. Fifteen. Ah, you are such a bitch. You're such a nasty bitch. That's the first dice roll as well. Motherfucker. I just spelled inspiration got, to convince you. Shit! I've got a tab to settle. Shit! Bye, 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 bye. Run, run, run. Oh my god, she's zooming. She flew from here. But honestly, I can't blame her. I would do the same. Yes, one tactician. Sorry, I didn't answer that. Um, the lower city walls are closest place, I think, if you want to fast travel to see Laura. Lower city wall. We do have that. Well, let's. What, what is this? That's Cora, that's Casador, that's Orpheus, Alexander. It still says to investigate the blushing mermaid. I don't think there's anything else to do here though. We spoke to that guy. I guess we spoke to Xena. We will speak to Xena, but then I think that's it. Keep bloody wits about you in here. The captive is trying to keep it hush hush, but I heard a kid got nabbed. Did you now? Curious, very curious. For me, it was the game itself, but I'm also using a different mod manager. You're not using Vortex. Can you mod the kisses back in at this point? I, you would hope so, because I'm certainly not gonna roll back to a save before the mods. That would be in like Act One, I think. Act Two, maybe. Hell, ages ago. Uh, I know the child's called Vanra, right? Um. Yeah, let's do this one. Knew it. No wonder Captain Grizzly shoots daggers at any. What is wrong with you? It. My guess, it's them squatters. Spotted a bunch of misfits sneaking into one of them boarded up houses. Ugh, animals. Lord Gortash will find that kid and sort all this out. Just you wait. 
Okay. It says still to invest, still, it, it's stuck here to still investigate, but I don't think there's anything else. Maybe I'll speak to these two. I feel like I did, but then at that point. You're going on a date? Are you joking? The city is a hair's breadth from violence and we're shipping off at first light. So? I'll be back by then. Mate, you'd be late to your own funeral. Look, skip the date and I'll take you out the next time we port, all right? Her eyes shine with concern and love. That of more than a friend. The armies of the absolute could attack at any moment and you're worried about a date? This woman clearly loves and worries about you. You should listen to her. Now, Kith. But here's the question. I succeeded the insight check. So normally, wouldn't this be the reward for receding, uh, succeeding the check? But that can't be the reward for succeeding the check. I feel like I'd want to do the persuasion. Does that not make sense? Yeah, I think you got the orange outfit and hair around when you fought the goblin leaders ish. I th I think so. That sounds about right. That's a good memory, uh, Arcania. I think so. If we're seriously, if we can get Java to roll back to Act One, also forget the game. I'm all for it. Adam, what do you mean? Yeah, you modded. Uh, you'd modded right when I found your stream. It had been sub, and I've been sub for three months. Guys, you don't understand. I just, it just takes me a while to play through games and then a lot of shit got in the way. Lord knows I was not intending for this to go on as long as it has. Not that I'm mad, not as, you know, it's a good game, but it'd be nice to be on like a second playthrough by now. Uh, well, I, I wouldn't go that far, but yeah. I'm worried about you, mate. The ship wouldn't be the same without you. Oh, come on. You know I'm a sucker for that soppy shit. Fine, no date. But let's say we grab another one here for the road. My treat. Deal. So cute. Okay, well, I'm glad that we got them on a date or something. Yeah, I, I think I've done... Did I... This will be the last person I speak to, and then I think we've spoken to everyone here. If you had to choose the red one or the blonde one, which should I? Which would you choose? You're talking about beers. What are you talking about? Shh. Red one or blonde one? I'm a blonde. You're right. You're so right. Is he talking about murdering them? Mosin, I knew it. I knew it was about beer. I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I. Oh gosh, guys. Oh, heavy is the head that wears a crown. Oh my word. Oh my word. Yeah, all right. That's everything done here. Oh, chest. Oh, but we're going to get in trouble. Let's not do that. All right, sorted. We can delete that. They're right there. So we might as well go warm them. I guess. And then lower city, I think, is the next one that I should be going to. Oh, no, we did this already, didn't we? I think we've I think we've done this already. Hopefully it's obvious enough when we get there. I wish that the marker would go away. Oh, the succeeding the insight makes the roll easier. That that makes sense. We we totally did this already, surely. Yeah, 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 cool, 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 yeah, 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 leave. That's so annoying. I really wish it would stay unmarked on the map because now I can't track what I've done, what I haven't done. Um, all right. I 
It's so, uh, Cora. We need to go check on Cora, I guess. Elden Ring went on for longer, and you have more hours in this. Why did that happen? What? And I'm actually asking sincerely. What? What? Because I would have started Elden Ring in end of January 2023, finished it July of 2023. What else got in the way? Good luck warning them. Wait, warning who? I would love more story and romance. You don't need to twist my arm for it. I think he's gorgeous. Uh, is it in here? Yeah, is it here? Oh, Alexander. Alexander must be here. Roger. Oh, no, it's Cora that I'm... Right? Cora? Yeah, it's Cora. Oh, I'm thrilled we can do this in a very public area. We need 24 hour Baldur's Gate stream. Exactly, Mac. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Second playthrough is way faster. You don't have to do everything, just the bits you want to do. Okay. Yeah, another playthrough more. Sorry. Yeah, I can confirm as a completion. A second playthrough is much faster, but still so much fun. Okay. Okay. Uh, if to be fair, if you had something something to prove when you're playing, you had something to prove when you're playing Elden Ring. It felt way more like a conquest than just a playthrough. But we did the trick, and like you'll notice, it's the same way that I'm playing Baldur's Gate for those of you, whatever. And it was the way that I played Elden Ring. Even though. I wanted to treat my first playthrough of Elden Ring and like my first playthrough of Baldur's Gate as like my only playthroughs of Elden Ring or Baldur's Gate where it's like I want to accomplish I want to do as much content as I can do like I get as close to 100%ing the game as you can um because you obviously can't 100% those games like that in your first playthrough uh so that's probably why it's taking so long it's a weird question but I'm a few episodes behind <clears throat> I'm a few episodes behind on YouTube this is your first live stream, yeah. But have you ever walked by a prayer building with a story in and Gail and had their conversation there? No, because I don't normally have Gail in the party. I only put Gail in the party m my last stream session, which is the only thing that's missing off of YouTube. That will be live as of the day that I'm recording this. That will be live tomorrow. Um, I don't know what the building is. Uh, but if I can, if someone can point me in the right direction, I would go and do that so we can hear that conversation. I'd be down for sure. RE4 remake. Well, oh, wait, hang on. We were just about to try some of Master Metzli's delightful wines. Oh, would you care to join us? Ooh, they do look ever so tasty. Ah, Mrs. Highbury, I prefer to conduct tastings individually, so I may assess your part. Ah! Call me Cora, Master Metzley, and I'm afraid I must insist on their joining us. Wine's no good without company, after all. The wine scent is almost sickly sweet. That's the with an acrid note just on the periphery. That's the dwarf. I think poison. I I think we've been hunting a dwarf in, in red and it's just clicked in my brain that I think this is the dwarf. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Also, we were delayed in finishing Elden Ring because I tried to play, I tried to play Jedi Survivor, uh, Tears of the Kingdom, Life is Strange, RE4 remake and something else surely, right? Anyway, that wine is poisonous. It's bad. It's trying to kill you. Can't I just attack him? Oh my gosh, this is gonna be awful. No, it was perfect, 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 perfect. You have sullied it with knowledge, made it an unclean sacrifice. I will remember your face. And I will peel it from your skull, should you interfere again. Ah! 
Discover the undying sentinel underneath the worm's crossing. Obvious Larian reference to the red dwarf. Is it? I, I don't get it. Um... I'm just so nervous Steel Watcher or some shit is going to join this fight and it's going to be a right ball ache. Hiding successful, but I was spotted by Delore because of dark vision. Oh, yeah, I don't have an advantage. Not the screaming. And I don't have an advantage. Of course I don't, because I failed the hiding. I don't know why I'm bothering to check with this. Um, okay. Create four ghouls that fight alongside me. I could. That could be some silly fun. I don't know if we need all that. Let me let me try something. Hold person. It's just a bunch of copies. That's the main one. That's the main one. Hold person. Why so low? I should try it though. Okay, good chat. No! Bye, sweetie! Evards would work strong here too. I'm bummed, dude. We, uh, what is this? We saved Cora Highbury from a barless serial killer disguised as a wine merchant. Figaro Pennygood is next on the target list. We need to find him before the killer does. He escaped! Congratulations! How much you want to bet Figaro is going to be fucking dead? I tried it. At least I had the brains to think to to think to do that. Figaro doesn't deserve to die. I, I don't want him to die. Disadvantage because of mind reader. What the shithole, what? This is terrible. What? I hate everything. Great. I'm not mad. You're mad. I'm not mad. I 
think they call this shitting the bed. What? How, how is Dribbles the clown updated? Based on how Dribbles has been caught up, it looks like we found half of his co- What? The real dead double- Yeah, what? We found- We've- What? Mom? Mom? I, I don't know where we think we found Dribbles. I'm confused. Focus. I can't even walk further forward. I don't think I can walk far forward enough to get him with... Can I? A little further forward? No, of course not. Whatever. Great, it's my turn. What the shit am I meant to do? Ugh. I can do it against him. I can do it against him. Can I jump? It's still gonna provoke an attack opportunity. I could misty step. How would that provoke an attack opportunity? Okay, great. What the fuck? It was a debate all along. What? I mean, because I've already taken the bloody thing. I hate... Hello? Got there in the end, bloody hell. I'm dead, dude, I'm so dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, okay, great. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I don't I, yeah, 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 yeah. What 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 do I want to do for main attack, dude? Flame strike this bitch. Flame, burn the whole thing in hell, dude. Yeah. I, I don't know what you're talking about, Gail. And fire, I, I can't even, I can't do any of this. <laughs> mm. 
Ay, 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 ay. Can I get him to like misty step away? I could. I could, I could. I hope this works like this, where I can do like, okay, misty step to like he here. <laughs> Such a waste. But I'll, and I can't, I probably can't even long rest after this because I need to go straight to Figaro, but it doesn't matter because he's probably effing dead anyway. Barely alive still. Oh, it's the weapon. Can I get the weapon and do this? Please, how much does this do? Big damage, big damage. Terrible baby damage. Could I still do this? Why am I having a disadvantage against them? Okay. Can I hide? Can't be threatened. Hide from anybody. What? How is that? How do I? Oh, oh, I can do it here. Okay, great. Okay, great. Uh, heal. Big heal. Okay. Another fight. Let's go. Yeah, can I even wild shape? I could. I would like to actually, I think. Let's do that. What? Yeah. Yeah. I'm not even mad, but it is kind of surprising that I can wild shape multiple times in a fight. Okay, and that. Yep. Great. Why the critical hits? Hello? Okay, walk. Great. <laughs> yeah, but we have a couple of we have a couple of problems. Dismiss the wild shape. Uh, dismiss short rest. I have no short rests. Ugh. Cancel that. What did I find of Dribble here? I don't think I found anything about Dribble here. <sighs> Shadowheart's outfit, nice. Thank you. We we care about the important stuff here. Uh, okay. I need to go to Figaro quickly. I feel like I don't have enough time to... Hang on. Cora's still in here. I think. Let's go talk... This way. Let's go talk Let's to Cora. Don't waste a step. Let me just save again. I want to have a word. I still can't believe... Why would anyone want to kill me? Thank you for saving us. Nice. And how much you want to bet because I spent the time to accept the money. I mean, Figaro is like long dead at this point. There's not a hope in hell that he's not. Um, Gail. How do I, sorry. All right. Is that blood? No, never mind. Swift as my feet can carry me. 
better not be cursed. It's unusual for prey to supply the tools of its own butchery. Razors, scissors, Jesus. nail files. So many cuts one couldn't make. And yet, such a fleeting window. But then, who am I to deny the auspices of destiny? For we are celebrating, Master Figaro. You have the delicious honor of being my crowning achievement. Your body is my ultimate gift to my lord, Bar. Together, we shall transcend. I, I hello I'm in the background <clears throat> Okay Hear me out I want to go stop right there and stop it in its tracks obviously Um but I feel like he's just going to disappear again But then I feel like if I do stealth keep to the shadows whilst the dwarf is distracted that because I want to try and stealth and nab him. Let's just try it. What? What's this check? I have a plus two dexterity. <clears throat> if he dies, so dies the underwear. High stakes in the game. Oh my god. I think I already saved. Let, let's try it. I think I saved. Can't have too many. Oh my god. We might be reloading this one. And if I can't succeed the dinosaur here, I'll let it play out and then maybe we just reload to try and say, come on, I've done through so much. Come on, big roll. Okay. You see. Huh? I'm confused. That surely didn't play out how they m mean it to. What? What? What's going on here? It's absolutely not working as intended, right? Reload and try again. Ugh. This has been like twice now, I think. Where at least twice, maybe more. Where something like way bugs out. I think you let him die. Ugh. Well, let's we we won't do the dice roll thing. Let's let's. There should have been a cutscene. It started to play. It's unusual for prey to supply razor, but. The Together, we Stop right there! The challenger, my lord, tests me. This piteous offer will be your grave challenger. Think I made the right decision not to stay. No way to run a business, I say. Can't even browse while you're doing clients. Sorry. Uh, I'm having a bit of despair because I didn't, I didn't rest. Because I thought I needed to get hit urgently. And I just feel like he's going to disappear again. But do I have to fight you? I have to fight him. I have to fight. I have to fight him. And I'm right next to him. Mm. And I can't. Like if I tried to. Oh, I could. No, but... Oh, I have Misty Step. Oh, because I didn't Misty Step as a Starion. I didn't Misty Step as a Starion. Um... 
Could I misty step? It still provokes an attack opportunity. Oh, because I'll have to walk forward. That's why. I don't know why I did that. Why not? Fuck it. Attack him! Stop it! Oh, never mind! <sighs> Rat row raggy! What am I meant to do if I can't wild shape? I have to use all my other spells. Um, it's so annoying that I can't move Gale because I'm wondering. Hang on, let me just save. No way to run a business, I, say. I could do cool lightning. Go all out. Yeah, he needs long. Oh, totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I need concentration for that. I need concentration for that. Create a wall of pliable vines twisted. Create, uh, creatures can move through the wall, but they take piercing damage per turn. The movement speed is quartered. I feel like wall of thorns might be better than burning f than... Burning fight back. Like, how does it work? Does it go like... I saved already, right? Let me just try it again. So if I was to do like that... Yeah, those two are in it. This is me thinking very, very hard. I would have liked to have gotten all three of them in it, but I don't think I can without nicking Gale. Um, and that's really going to suck if I do that. Um, so I'm half tempted to move here so I can get them both in it uh, and slow them down. But, okay, he's going to have to go for the door. But he, he seems to be engaging in the fight. Gale's a trooper. He'll understand. Can I at least... Maybe if I just, like, stand here. Let's see how it goes. No way to run a business, I say. Can't even... Wow, I get Gale and Shadowheart in it. Okay, wait. Cancel. Cancel. Can I move, like, here? still get them in it. I don't know. This might be a terrible idea. You can cast it further out. It does have to start from you, right? Can it go like that? Oh, I see. Okay, wait. Cancel. Can it go from like here? Like that. It seems like I can't do it without at least nicking Gale. Okay, cancel. Can I can I start it here? No way to run a business, I say. Can't even browse while No, that gets them both.
because I need to I need to touch one of them right or can I end it here I don't think so I think I need to like properly attach to one of them I know the lady ch chatting outside like that So I don't think it's going to let me do it like that. Yeah, I have to hit one of them. We'll see. Hello? Calling Major Tom. Wall of Thorns. What, what's being blocked? It was blocked by the mirror in the corner. No, what? This mirror? No way to run a business, I say. Can't even browse while he's with a client. What the shit heap? Uh, it's like his fucking pinky toe. There certainly is no way to run a business, I say. Fair, fair enough what Hammer has going. Yeah, it can't overlap with indestructible. Sacrifice Gale, just like Mistra, stop. I think I'm go we're just going to have to do that. This is, uh, whatever. Um, no way to run a business, I say. Can't Sunbeam requires concentration. Maybe we just do Ice Storm. That did fuck all. That was a terrible choice. At least he's pinned down. It did nothing. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah, go on. Critical miss, great. Oh, they fight for themselves. Interesting. I mean, we need to stop her ASAP. I would rather him stay here though. I can't Misty Step because I used it already, stupidly. Um, is she still alive? She Oh, she is. She's got a lot of health left. Okay, okay. Let, let's stay focused up. What have I got? What have I got? What, um, isn't it if you freeze and then use fire, you can, you, uh, it afflicts some kind of brittle, right? Or is it fire and then freeze? I forget the correct order. Fire and then freeze. Son of a bitch. Um, enemy has to be frozen first. That sucks. Um... These are three baddies clustered together. Yeah, they are. No way to run a business, I say. Well, I guess, Can't hang on, let's save. Can I get him to close the door? Okay, cool. I don't know why that feels like a good choice. Um, fireball. F I mean, there's part of me that just goes fuck it and do wall of fire. But I don't know if I can, can I even like, I saved, right? Like out of theory, can I, 
Can I do like here? No, it's not going to let me go do all that. If I did that, it would get those. Th uh, okay, hang on. Cancel. If I start it going from like here. Oh wait, is that targeting me? Here? 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 So you stopped queuing because you felt funny. What the shit? I was so boring. I'm sh I'm trying to even think of what the hell I want to do, honestly. Um I could try and freeze the group of people here. I could try it and then use fire on it. Saved. Everything's stupid. Everything is stupid and I hate it. Supreme healing. Don't I have one of potion? Oh, healing. Healing. Superior. Shadowheart's got them. Pass the parcel. Yeah. What do I want to do? Difficult terrain. Lo I don't have a level five spell slot. Do you think we could swim? Can't use that right now. I don't even know if I use it properly. Freedom of movement. Snap an ally out of something or other. Let's go here. Might use a healing spell and then... Oh, I don't have the level five spell slot. <sighs> what are my level four spells? Healing, healing, healing. Inflict wounds. It's just the spirit guardian shit, isn't it? Maybe I just do spirit guardian. It's so boring, but maybe I just do spirit guardians and then rah rah. Mass healing. That's my only level three spell slot. Hang on. Spirit guardians. Yeah. Let's do this as the weapon. Nope. Cool. Okay. And I got that. Oh yeah. Uh huh. Shouldn't that do more damage since he's fallen down and can't get back up? Um. Leave it. Yeah. I'm saved from the blindness, I think. Uh, not enough movement. Okay, wait. Hide? Can't I hide from her? Why can't have anyone spot me? Ugh. Um. Scorching Ray, I guess. Disadvantage, because she has Mind Reader, which means ranged attacks are going to do worse, right? Dark Vision, Mind Reader, ranged attacks. Ugh. I, I hate everyone. Um.
I could action surge, but I don't think there's anything I want to action surge to do. I don't want to do any of that stuff. Oh, we'll just suck farts. When I said suck farts, I didn't mean it like that. Perfect. Uh, he's prone. It's so annoying. If I could wild shape, dude. That kills me. That kills me. I would have such a strong melee attack against him. Um... Can I stack Shillelagh? Does anyone know? Sorry, question. The safe word that we have in stream is Kit Kat. Can I stack Shillelagh to buff my weapon or not? Your staff clubs it deals and use the spell casting ability for attack rolls. Stack it. I, I just want to make my. I wanted to use like a melee attack on him since he's prone, but I was trying to buff up my melee attack. It's only going to do 7 to. 7 to 17 damage. It's like lame. Don't think so. Boo! Yeah, with itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I think I used it on my offhand attack earlier. Um, That blows. I'm so annoyed that that's happened. Uh, I've already used Shalali previously. So by stacking, I mean, can I use it twice to like further increase the damage that it does? Uh, and the answer is no. Because now like, I don't even know what I, what I would want to do with my offhand, my like bonus thing. I, I might just try and main hand attack. That seems so dumb though, but I'm like, he's, he's prone. So it should do more. Turn the creature's first harder stone. It takes only half damage or not much. Yeah, no. Um, I think I used it already. Yeah, Kali, yeah, yeah, yeah. No way to run a business, I say. Can't even browse while you can fly. Realize I have no idea how to pronounce that spell's name. Shalali. <laughs> To be fair though, I said it, it's, a shillelagh is like a word that I've heard a lot in life, but I've not, never seen it spelled. So when I first booted up uh, Baldur's Gate, I think it was like basic even might have corrected me. Wall of fire or a fire spell melts the ice, making them vulnerable to ice and electric. Oh, sure. Cause it'll be icy. Cause the floor will be wet. In it. But I can't even, hang on. I think this is the thing that annoys me. I don't even know like a good position to do the wall of fire. Not that, not that, not that, not that, not that. I feel like the position, is this not wall of fire? Hang on. Yeah. Hang on, okay. Does it not go like here? Target's too far. Oh, cause I'm. Do you think we could swim into the other sea? Through the river.
Gale cannot take it. Also, it's both Gale and Shadowheart. Fucking mad more than like, bro. I don't know how this is possible. How this is even possible? Java H Gale. No, I don't. I'm desperately trying to save that. To to. <sighs> Each final target is hit with. Di I don't know what that is. I I. You can start it just beyond the law, so it doesn't hit my characters. I think I have to. That sucks so bad. Oh, he might still be in it. I don't know. Let's try it. No way to run a business, I say. Can't even browse while he's with a client. What do you mean? Okay. All right. That's worked. End this shit right now. Mental shit. Mental. Now hang on. Great, there is water here. There is water here. Lightning bolt calls all the blast of lightning that hits all creatures in the line of eruption. So couldn't I do like... Couldn't I do like this? And they're both in water? Let's hope. He is saved from the lightning bolt. What fucking... I was about to see like... Uh, what? No way to run a business, I, Can't even I was about to be like, what fucking de pact with the devil has Delore made that he can survive so much shit? But we already know the answer to that. He took zero damage. Zero damage doing that. Zero. I'm so annoyed. I don't even know what I want to do. I just end it. That might be so silly that I ended that. Yeah. At least we're getting the critical hit here, finally. Go attack this thing. Okay, weapons attack? It's the weapons attack. Okay, part of me is like, do I use the weapons attack to just hit Delore when he's down? So that he'll, because he'll take more damage since he's prone. Or should I just kill Wog? That's what I'm trying to think right now. Has rogue levels, evasion, zero damage when you succeed on dexterity save instead of half damage. But he's prone. The motherfucker is prone. That's why it shouldn't work like that. Let's try and do this. Hey, Capital G, how's it going? Lovely. Did barely anything that wasn't worth it at all. I should have killed that. I mean, jeez. Uh, he might not be caught in. I might just, like, let me just kill this one, I think. Has he already taken damage from my... Yeah, he has. Um... Uh, 
It's total chaos, various coast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Total absolute chaos right now. Unfortunately, this might be a terrible, terrible mistake. Critical hit, just like spit in my face. Spit in my face! And I'm going to use one of my level four spell slots. Is he, is Astarian included in this? Of course not. Um, just do it. Seventeen attack. Could I even like? I don't think it would work like this. Oh, I use my misty step. Um. It's only got 17. It's only got 17. Just, I just reckon just, just sort it out. Uh, trip attack, uh, pushing attack ranged, uh, pushing attack melee, summoning attack melee, summoning attack ranged. Can I just do, no, because it must have a weapon. That makes sense. Piercing shot. Just like a, what do you? It's ten. Ugh, it's ten. Ugh. Cantrip. Three to thirty, but I'm like right in his face, so it's not gonna. It's gonna be worse. Because this thing, I don't want to do the main hand attack because I would have to be so lucky with the roll to get it to be right. Maybe you just fucking magic missile it. It's kind of dramatic. Just please kill it. Come on. Tormented. Okay, great. Um, and now let's position me like here and that. Great. Oh, fantastic. Hello. Great. Great. What? What in tarnation? Why the hell would you do that? Well, finally, the water's electrified. <laughs> Which is all I was hoping for originally. I think this is the only guy in the fight, right? Yeah, it's that guy. Um, it's kind of lame. How much health does he have? Like, okay. Oh, but it froze the water. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, the ghouls will go get it. If they run through the fire and then fall on the ice, I just know this is going to be some silly shit. Go fall on the ice. Okay, great. At least he fell on the ice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good luck, guys. Great. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ah, historian! Are you crazy? He died? How did he die? Stop, guys, stop, stop. Oh my God. You were witnessed assaulting someone. You're headed for the cell. Who are you? What? Who is this? Why are they here? Why is this happening? Where the fuck did they come from? I am so confused. 
Why am I getting arrested? Why am I getting arrested? Have you lost your mind? She's investigating the same thing. I beat her to it. Oh my God. I can't afford to pay you off. She's a flaming fist girl who was paralyzed in the corner, but has been investigating Dolores murder spree. Will you calm your shit? Why are you gonna fight me? My wall of fire was still- Oh my god. I didn't know the guy had died. I didn't see that he- Oh my god. I was just swatting away an insect. Any contact was in a hurry. Unless you want to be next. Just a bit of harmless fisty cuffs. Nothing- Oh, for fuck's sake. I was solving your murder. I hate everyone, dude. I just know this is not going to be high enough. Oh my god, thank god. You're free to go this time. But next time you won't be so lucky. I mean, for fuck's sake. I should have known it would be you. Thank you. If it had been the dwarf alone, we might have stood a chance. But these doppelgangers, oh, they swarmed us. We were paralyzed before we even had the chance to fight back. Weren't you supposed to be protecting Patriots in the upper city? Those doppelgangers are tracking, are tracking his progress. Apparently this one's a rising star amongst the ballast. Good thing I was here to save you then. Well, full, I'm sure you have a lot of paperwork to do. I'll leave you to it. I hate fighting in the city because of that. I had someone thank me for saving them and just got arrested. I would be fuming. I'd be so mad. She just tried to rob me. I Honestly, Chishko. I'm fucking appalled. Um, and thank you guys for the follows, by the way. Thank you, lovely followers. Welcome in. Um, those top are, tra are tracking his progress. Apparently, this one's a rising... Let's say this. Let me just save again. We're saving an obscene amount. It's just how things go here. We're all used to it by now. A rising star, you say? Then perhaps it's a good job I ran into him. I was on my way to the upper city when I heard a commotion. I stepped in to see if I could help. It's not every day you have the chance to catch a killer in action. Not even in this profession. It's kind of weird. These killings aren't random. In fact, they seem to be part of some sort of test. Yes, we know that by now. That document you showed me before, the one with the victims' names on it, that was the briefing. We, we know that. The killers paralyze their victims take their hands as an offering for Baal and make it look like the cult of the absolute was behind it all. It grants them access to a tribunal. From what I could gather, it's some sort of rite of initiation for aspiring cultists to prove their worth. And it's taking place beneath Candle Hallow's tombstones. Like I said before, it's not something I can look into in an official capacity. But you... I suppose I'd better go and find a hand then. Candle Hollow's tombstones. Any idea where that is? S I guess we should ask where it is. It's I think I know. I've never heard of, if I'm honest. But rumor has it there were some hidden cellars somewhere near the elf. I feel like we've been there. Technically, I haven't yet done an inventory of this crime scene. So if. Uh, Something were to go missing from a corpse. She's very pretty. Uh, I'll take a look into it. And I'll pick up where I left off. The upper city. When I'm done, I'll stop by the basilisk. Gir Girly Pop didn't even finish her sentence. What is going on, guys? What intonation? I, I I feel like more and more the the mods are making things so wonky, and I don't know I I don't know how to fix it, to be honest. Don't need to finish your sentences when you're that hot. That's how it works. Tombstone shop key and a murderous masterpiece. Okay. You never got any convo with her. All right. Did you break Baldur's Gate? It seems it. Uh, 
Penultimate report. It's an honor and a privilege to watch this brother in Baal in action. The setup for his fin uh, final qualifying murder is brilliant and meticulous. After its inevitable culmination, I will be thrilled to join as the murder tribunal and acclimating to law as an unholy assassin. Oh, that's he's been robbed already. Yeah, we'll speak. Where is Delo? Delo? Oh, here, here, here. There we go. Yeah, I updated mods, but I, I, I would have updated them when last I checked. I mean, geez. There's a lot of stuff here. And of course, I'm encumbered. Let's save. Hang on. I kind of feel like, can you wear the red armor? Elegant studded leather. No. Hang on. Am I not, ho no. Am I not holding it? Sorry, latest. Scarlet leather armor. Okay, wait. Scarlet leather armor. It's too much. It's too, it's way too much going on. It was a nice thought. I, I like this music. Uh, Senat Camp. Dimension Door. What do his boots do? Oh, the Misty Step. Still breathing, despite that might be... These... Oh, but it's a level four spell. Let me just send these to camp. I don't know. I don't know. No one come for me. Torn and bloody page. Oh, Delore, um, it's a dagger. What What do your daggers do? Six to 18. Oh, no, hell, yeah, yeah. S send that shit to camp. Send to camp, send to camp. Okay. The following text is printed haphazardly on a torn bloody page titled, Dirge of an Unholy Assassin. Neath Candle Hollow's quiet tombs lies a path to murder's boons. If entry down below your aim, if entry down below your aim, seek trigger hidden by a frame. Sicarius the door awaits to admit those who seek their fates. If to continue you insist, show a trophy rent from wrist of, of sacrifice for our Lord planned, present death's night a bloodied hand. Surely it's hand. <laughs> but we're smart. Um and a location. Uh, we should find this candle hollow place. Stelmain's hand, Logan's hand, Alexander's hand, Frank's hand. Got a whole bag full of hands. Okay, okay, alright. It's a handbag get it well done Callie well done what a cute handbag coming hey it's a great theme huh the other armor story I was wearing yeah better stats it all worked out for the best in the end make haste I have a very busy day of very demanding clientele ahead what do you require uh there is no you're honestly not gonna say thank you nothing I get nothing. Just a little kiss on the forehead and a job well done. I'm fuming, mate. Surely, come on. That's crazy talk, that is. Um, all right. Uh, oh, it gives me a discount. Make haste. But I would I like if you at least said, like, very demanding clientele ahead. Very good, ma'am. You know, thank you so much for saving my life. I think I have the best looking underwear is the only thing because I bought that. I'm already wearing that. Well, I should have waited to buy shit until I saved his life. Eminent obsidian outfit. I mean, those are like for camp and shit. Lame. Lame, 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 lame. 
Now remember, fashion's a fickle mistress, so be sure to return. He says something if you save hip Cora and then Figaro, but I did go save Cora. I saved Cora and then Figaro, I think. You know what I do need to do right now? I need to long rest. We're in shambles. Let's go long rest. Yes. I think I need to buy more camp supplies or something. Look at me! I look stunning! Um, does anyone want to talk to me? Yeah! You daft bastard! What are you doing here? Um, I guess I'll go talk to Alminster. Let's talk to Astarian, because, duh. We always talk to Astarian. Please. Is there something you want to talk about, my dear? A kiss? Us. I still love the sound of that. I kind of like being covered in blood. How could I say no? I know it's the same kiss, but I still love it. Oh, you are perfect. Every time. Matthias, welcome in chat. How's it going, lovely? How are you doing? Uh, all right, let's go save. Let's talk to Elminster. Elminster? Mind me, I'm just enjoying a lungful of bull durian <laughs> yeah, There's a distinctive aroma, though perhaps not one worthy of bottling. I hear you've been browsing in the most esteemed of emporiums, sorcerous sundries. <laughs> uh, indulge my curiosity. What wonders did you discover there? Uh, we found the Annals of Corsus. I proved it proved an enlightened read. You don't seem all that surprised to see Gale alive and well. Oh, nothing in particular. Some charms here, some potions there. We know Corsus made his crown and Gale's going to reforge it. Ugh. Uh, shit. Maybe let's ask number two and then we go number one. Let's try and deflect a little bit. I trusted he would be sensible enough to exercise caution in this matter and to seek the truth. By now, you are aware of the evil we are up against. Cassos's pestilent crown, the very tool with which its eponymous creator unmade an empire and magic itself. Perhaps now you understand what is at stake here, my boy. Though what Mr. asked of you was extreme, it was not without merit, nor demanded lightly. What are you saying? Or rather, what are you not saying? Gosh, Gail's Mr. voice is great. knows you defied her, Gail. But of course she knows. She's Mistra. She bids you come to her holy shrine in the Stormshore Tabernacle. There, she will grant you an audience at last. You should meet her, Gale. She might be able to help us. You really think Mistra will be willing to hear Gale out? Mistra's done Gale enough harm. We don't owe her anything. Sounds good to me. Gale can tell her exactly what's coming when we get our hands on the crown. Stay silent. I think I might stay silent in this. I think I will, Babette. Hi. I don't think so, but the next session we definitely will, Babette. Yeah. Uh, going good, just going from family uh, for Easter. It's your first stream I'm watching you. You enjoy the YouTube channel very much. It makes me so happy to hear. Welcome, welcome in. That's brought a massive smile on my face. You lovely. Um, let's let Gail answer for himself and see. Mr. is willing to speak to me again. Was this Ooh. your doing, Elminster? She knows what I see in you. Just as I know what she sees in you. <laughs> I was not born an old man i know all too well what it's like to have a goddess 
fill your heart with longing. Looking at you is like gazing into a mirror that shows centuries long past. The past is the past, Elminster, and the future is, well, still to be decided by me, not by Mistra. Awkward. If there is another way, I trust you can find it. It is not in your nature or mine to stop looking, to accept the first answer to any dilemma. Do what you can. Put that mind to work. Trust in yourself. Trust in the weave. If you are willing, trust in Mistra. There is a conclusion yet to be written in this sorry tale, Gale of Waterdeep. And yours is the quill that will write it. Nah, I don't know about that, guys. So you don't fuck with Mistra like that. Hey guys, thank you for the follows. Welcome in. Uh, Maria, welcome in. Hi, what mods do I use? I see that um, we've done... Uh, thank you, CM, has done the command for the mods. Um, so you can see that those are the mods. I have them on Nexus. I will say... Oh, I'm encumbered, aren't I? Yeah. Um, I will say that um, I've been having particular issue. I've noticed it mostly uh, this session. No, I mean, it's, I've seen it a couple times, but um, I've been having issues with the game. It's been messing with the game. Some cutscenes aren't playing quite like they should be. Uh, I don't know if it's maybe just like a me thing and I need to, I don't know, better. I need to make sure. I, I'm pretty sure my mods are all up to date. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm just warning that that's been a bit of a problem. What's in this? Yeah, all my key items. It's like that goes in there, that goes in there. And that stays with me, obviously. Throwable stuff. Huh? Why is this happening? What is happening? Oh, it's swapping. It was swapping. Sorry, thank you. Huh? You can tell I manage my inventory so much. It's a joke. Nice and clean. Not a singular problem. Uh, hi, Mitsun. Welcome in. How's it going? The background tune is so good, huh? So good. You having us casual tonight? I'll be. You'll be traveling next weekend. No. Well, maybe do it the weekend after. I don't know. That makes me sad. I don't want you missing it. I couldn't help overhearing what Elminster said to Gail. Not every day a god asks for a chat. Hey, maybe I'm invited too. I can be the muscle. The emperor, no, leave. Thanks for the follows, lovelies. Welcome in. Yeah, Gail's story aches. Oh, sorry, arc is making me wish my ex would return cosplay. Stop. Hey, Maria. Yeah, thank you very much. Of course. Yeah, so my... I'm in the underwear now, um, which is why I look like this, but I'm normally wearing, the hair is modded in, this uh, circlet's modded in, and then I'm wearing a version of Orin's armor that is white, it's colored white. I've got these like leg bracers, like things that are from Orin, and then the actual um, braces I have, they're the lover's braces. They don't give me, I don't get any like perks for the armor. There's no special, I'm not like juiced up or anything. My AC is 17. Yeah. 
Uh, and then I don't think anyone. Oh, and then I do have Shadow Heart in. Um, I do have Shadow Heart in modded <laughs> clothes, which I think uh, it's just for the looks. I love her dress like this. And then cheeks, tasteful. We have tasteful cheeks. I am very fond of this look for her. Yeah. 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 The place Elmer still wants to go to is the Star and Gale. Oh, where the Star and Gale conversation happens. Okay, great. Okay. Yeah. Oh, thank you, CM. Yeah. I keep losing entire bags and then I realize it's because the game doesn't like you searching and then dragging things from one character's inventory to another. Interesting. It feels a bit finicky, um, to be honest. Let's talk to Astarian because he was in earshot of this. So, Mistress requested a chat with Gale. Unusually polite for a god. I do hope it goes well. We've pissed off enough gods already. True cute okay uh let's let's rest so we've just done we inept we unintentionally um handled the death death people death the, the ballist plot thing uh and so now we are trying to i want to try and wrap up the stuff with the hag so let's Oh shit. What? Yeah. What? Hey, Thorn and Decide, welcome in, lovely. That's really cool. I need to look them up. Yeah. Also, playing a first playthrough. Loving the game, but want to spice up the looks. I'm totally with you. I will. The only thing I will knew this is the first game that I've ever modded. Um, I don't normally mod games that i play uh but we are all about the fashion here and we spend so much time with our tab i wanted us all looking a particular way but it has interacted with the game not not like crashes but it's been little funky things here and there like i've not yet experienced a new kiss animation because of it so just like a heads up i'm sure there's a solve for it and i've just not figured out what the solve is uh thank you for the hydrate fey light welcome in thank you guys for the follows as well Roland is grateful for our help. Yeah, uh, securing his position at Rasmus Tower. We can rely on the tower's full power should we need it. I think that's the update. We found a note in the killer Dolores' pockets, instructing him to enter Candle Hollow's tombstone with a passphrase. It seems a bar's cult may be there. We've taken the serial killer Dolores' sick trophies, the hands of his victims. We can use these to access the Dreadlord's tribunal underneath Candle Hollow's tombstone to find out how to enter the temporal ball. But. Based on how Tribbles has been cut up, it looks like we found half of his corpse. But we got Tribbles' severed hand. But I, I don't think we did, though. That's what I'm not understanding. Dribbles? Oh, clown? We do have the hand, but when did I... When did I get the hand? I don't think it's in the bag, right? I don't... I don't know. Um, what club is that top from? It's not a club top. Um, it's a, it's a Adidas tracksuit, uh, in collaboration with Bathing Ape. Bape, the brand, Bathing Ape. Someone there. But I do support, for better or for worse, I do support Chelsea. Um, so it is Chelsea, Chelsea Blue. Probably from Delore, but I didn't get, I didn't get to Delore, it, I, I, it was before I had received the hand, but the hand, hand, the handbag. I'm confused. Yeah, I only have modded in The Sims like, oh crazy, because I know how to do it, but other games I need to look how it's done. Honestly, I'm, maybe I'm not the best one to give you advice on how to do it because I've been having issues, but I just, um, I have Nexus mods uh vortex from nexus mods and it makes it dead easy you're really better speaking to master figaro he'll be able to find you an outfit that's just right oh is that gail that wants to talk yes it is what's going on um <laughs> thank you various you probably got the clown hand from popper yeah i got that ages ago it's possible delore had it but usually popper has it I think I definitely got it from Popper. Because can I not do... 
didn't I think it even said it when I looked at the hand Seven hand with the ring finger the ring was smelted with a grinning face on the band no where did I oh from the notebook maybe we found the hand in the circus shop run by Popper the Kobold. Yeah, it looks like it belonged to Dribbles the Clown. We found the foot, we found the arm. Part of Dribbles used to create a gruesome art piece to continue searching for the body parts. We found the torso. The dead doppelganger revealed their mistress wanted the clown's body parts for her art. But I, did I, am I missing his, I think I own the torso, right? I think so. Cl clown. I have the torso, the hand, the foot, the arm. So I don't know why it's updated. So all it took to get Mistress' attention was to learn how to reforge an artifact that once destroyed her. It's obvious when you stop to think about it. What do you think she wants to say? She's scared of you. You're once up close to being able to challenge her. How could she possibly know we read a book? Hasn't she got more important things to worry about? Are you sure you want to go to her? She might want to punish you. Let's try this. What do you think she wants to say? Well, I doubt it's an apology for asking me to die on her behalf. Whatever it is. If it's important enough to send Elminster, we can be damn sure she's serious. This is a conversation that's long overdue on both sides. I owe it to her to hear her out. Come what may afterwards. Not yet, but soon. <laughs> Very well. But it does not serve us to tarry when a summons from the heavens is waiting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Good stuff. Uh, removed the curse in Astarian. Yeah, wait, why do I still have the curse right now? How do I remove it? I thought, I just thought the bait logo looked like, oh, that, because it's damaged in the wash. It's an ape. And he's bathing. No, I don't know why. To be honest, it's called that. I quite like this color on me though. Jacket's nice, the blues are on point. Thank you. It's so funny. I think this is the most anyone's ever commented on something that I've um, worn. At least it feels like it. And I'm not mad. I'm not mad. I'm not mad. Anything of use? Remove, uh, remove curse bell on shots. No. But can we... Uh, ha you go pick it up. Oh, okay. Well, I picked it up. My face protects me. Do I even have remove curse on her i would need to set it up i think i've got a long road ahead um all right i need to delete this delete that investigate the blushing mermaid i feel like i did that already great we have fewer markers on the map now which is lovely that's very very nice uh what is this murder target frank why is that still on there why is this one still on here? Did I miss something with Frank? Because all the other ones have disappeared. Uh, I don't know. Let's check it out. Oh, Frank always stays on for you as well. Okay. Let's just double check. I think we should be able to check fairly quick. I, I swear I need to find a way forward i swear i something good here i hope well this is probably not the right spot frank is in that one yeah request to join the hag survivors uh i write this to, uh, to you with shame in my heart my brother the light of my life fell prey to an evil hag he sought fame and fortune and she gave it to him he now sits in my hometown square a statue at the heart of the fountain a plaque at his feet reads toss a coin for luck water spills into the square sometimes so overflowing is the fountain with coppers i failed him i was so wrapped up in my own pain that i didn't notice his and then i saw your poster advertising your meetings about other hag survivors could i join i think it would do my heart good to meet others like me who have suffered that's from jatlo but jatlo was the jatlo was the um he, hang on journal 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 yeah we disposed of the hag spy named jatlo yeah so that, that was the spy A crooked touch. i don't know if i even need to lock pick this frankly
Uh, maybe it's something to do with that that wall you couldn't get through. Oh, Michael. Maybe. How's it going, Michael, by the way? Welcome in. Maybe. No. W what's curious? Wait, what? Did anyone see what's curious? We've done it. I took sweat, blood, and tears, but we've done it. We know how to kill a hag. Meet me at, yeah, old Garlo's. It's going to change everything. We've gotten that already. The onion potato, garlic, rusty ha- oh, for fuck. Yeah, just clean. Hag research notes. I mean, eviction notice. I have had it. Snowstorms inside the house, blood weeping from the windows. And now Mr. Wimbley's cat is vomiting up frogs. The poor man had a bloody heart attack from the shock. I know you lot are trying to fight back against hags or whatever. And that's great, honestly. But I can't risk the neighborhood just because you were stupid enough to piss off a hag. Keep your rent. I want you out by tomorrow. Mm. Well, I don't know what perception check. I, I, uh, barely legible letter. Let's try that. Dear Mr. Adriel, Claire found a place. A nice old man called Mr. Garlo used to live here, but his neighbor said he doesn't live here anymore. Claire thinks it's perfect. We can hide from the hag or fight or whatever you think is a good idea. Claire knows you have a good plan. Claire will wait for you in old Garlo's. Well, we've done all that already. Um, Okay. So I don't know what he perceived. Read the book and the pamphlet. Did I steal the book or did someone else? A seemingly random uh, I think I swear I've done this. Chapter eight. Yeah. Pure speculation despite its title. Had it hag encounters good details and hag gestation and reproduction rep reprodu whatever. <laughs> My Nogles College update uh, Dragon Egg Mushroom Autumn Crocus non reactive. F yeah, this that didn't help me at all. Was this Marina's house? No, yes, it must have been Marina's house. No, no, it couldn't have been. So Jatlo had the bit in the mailbox. Baron's Baron's coop? Because Marina put the letter under Property the door. In constant use. Gathering strictly prohibited. Marina put the note under the door. Chatlo had the letter in the mailbox. All's well that ends not as bad as it could have. Hmm. Right. Curious. Light on my feet. Yeah, this is it. This is it. And we've definitely done this. I'll check the thing downstairs. Because we've, yeah, inspected Frank. Surely. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. We went down the hatch. Yeah, empty, empty. I, I, I think this is probably just a glitch. Because I think I did everything down here. Because we would have fought... Empty. <laughs> Who farted? CM, thank you for doing the fart. It's odd. It's so quiet for me these days. Oh, yeah, we got the strong box. Yeah, this just stays on here, I guess. There must not have been anything worthwhile. No. I deemed not. Okay, let's leave. To put my hands on everything. CM, open a window. Can you kill most people in the city if you try? Why the hell would you want to know that? Nosy. Um. So let's go. Let's delete that. No, don't want to do that yet. That's mistress thing. Yep. Uh, okay. I wanted to carry on with the hag stuff. The hag is still listing as investigating. The Blushing Mermaid. Is there... 
is there something else that I should be doing at the Blushing Mermaid that I didn't already? I feel like I spoke with everyone. I can show you... I can show you the, uh... Uh... Log for it, if that's helpful. Yeah, more. there's more. Okay, there's more, there's more. Um... What is the closest fast travel? I guess that is. Horse cack. Blushing mermaids. Someone did a run where they killed literally everyone. Wow. I'm pretty sure you could turn Baldur's Gate into a ghost town if you tried. That's crazy. Hang on. Save. Not for communal use, it seems. Best show some respect. Or some more cunning. Did you bury the chest, you dumb bastard? No, you didn't. Who spotted me? They're not even looking. What? Why do you care? Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. How else am I meant to block your view? You stole that. Trust me. Kill him, I might do. There's nothing even interesting in it. Wanker. What now? Um, all right. Can't slow down. Look, you spill all these cabbages. Uh, all right, who else can I talk to here? There, you're asleep. Tongs, maybe I've not spoken to. If I'm not swinging a hammer working, I'm swinging a mug here drinking. Merry fair weather. I'm gonna catch me up. It's so unfair. I tried to go to Duke Gorgeous ceremony, but it was a closed event. All I wanted was a peek at him. He's gorgeous. Okay. This uniform's neat, isn't it? Why am I? Oh, wait. I had a shift at the counting house. Oops. <laughs> I'm off the clock, do Carl. Or I would be if it weren't for this blithering idiot. If you've got business at the counting house, it's just down the road. Okay. What's going on? What's all this then? How's it going, Poetic? The see, why would you want to kill the sleeping person? Yeah, you know Gortash using mind control tricks if anyone thinks he's gorgeous. One last binge is just what we needed. Because tomorrow we wake up as flaming fists. Okay. This isn't the malarkey I thought it was gonna be. Oh, that plum prosecco. Oh god, never again. Never again. Solemn vow. Solemn vow. Solemn. <laughs> All right. Canales bonds, Dickon. You're wasted. Wasted. <laughs> For the content. Oh, I, 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 I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Are you? Is there? It, 
Right out. Has there not been content enough? Me falling ass first into combat when I wasn't expecting it? Hmm? 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 That's easy for you to say. Excuse. You're rude. Um, okay. Let me think. So... Do we care about these claws? I don't think so. Spoken to both of them. Rules in the bar. Do we need to read the rules in the bar? That'll be a good laugh. Uh, no fights, no magic decanters, no gobbing in the glasses. Gobbing? What is gobbing? You smack a passing server's bottom, you forfeit the offending hand, get frisky with your partners elsewhere. You don't have to tip, but it does help us verify you aren't an asshole. You spill it, you buy it, drink plenty of water, and let a member of staff know if you feel sick or unsafe. Adventurers, leave your curves at the door. This is where you let your hair down, right? I like that. You don't need to sh shout at me. Mom, she is shouting at me. Nothing worthwhile there, no. All right. Now, I'm fairly certain I've spoken to all the people who have names here. The quarter soon. The quarter soon. And next up, the quarter soon, a guide to sexuality. Oh, is this supposed to be like the Karma Sutra? The quarter soon. The guide to sexuality, eroticism, and emotional fulfillment. Detailed diagrams accompany every page. On your journey to sensual alignment, treat each passionate encounter as a dance. Your movements should flow from one to another, like a river through the mountains. For instance, it would likely be uncomfortable for you and your partner, or partners, to move immediately from the bugbear bend to the underdark choke. Instead, after sensuous positions, gentler ones such as the threading of the weave or transitive plane are encouraged. It is also important to treat your partner's care post-encounter as the final step to this dance. Re uh, recipes for scented oils for exhausted muscles, tea blends for sore throats, and massage tips can all be found in later chapters. How great! They have their own version of the Kama Sutra. Are you okay? Oh, the stairs here. So will you bring me Laura's head? Or do I have to sleep with what I open tonight? Curious. Hmm. Okay. Having a drink whilst watching this, yeah, is the true immersion, exactly. But do as the uh, do as the instruction said, and make sure you're um, drinking water as well. Oh, it's quite a small basement. Okay, pile of sacks. We don't need the sandals. Is there nothing else to interact with around here? No, doesn't seem it. There is someone whistling. Okay. Also, thank you, thank you guys about saying there's more to explore. I, I assume, obviously don't tell me, I assume that this is the um, continuing to, to, that there's more to explore at the mermaid, that this is it. Uh, but, uh, yeah, someone was like, I don't have to tell you without spoiling. Literally just, what, uh, which is to say like, yeah, there's more to explore. I think you were going to talk to Laura, Vanra's supposed mother. I wasn't... Okay, I wouldn't... I would want to potentially, but it's not... You've told me where it is, but it's not marked on my map. So I was like, oh, maybe I should go continue to explore more and then talk to her. Um, But am I correct in thinking that that's not a smart way to think about it? To do it like that. Not booze flavored water, for God's sake. One of us has to be bloody responsible. Once you're level capped, you can get powerful items and allies. Oh, from quests, cool. I would like to subscribe to the channel. I don't think it's a weekly posting. It could be though. You never know. Hi, Angelus, welcome in, how's it going? 
look through my journal and see. I don't think it's that. Hey, Link! Thank you so much for the tier one, two months. You lovely. Who? Indeed. Um, let's look through the notes. Save Vanra. At Basilisk Gate, we met distraught Laura. I assume she's still near Basilisk Gate. She claimed her daughter Vanra is missing and that she vanished when the pair were in the Blushing Mermaid. She begged us for help. The Blushing Mermaid bartender told us that Laura was behaving strangely. She even pulled a knife on him. The owner of the tavern, Captain Grizzly, had to throw Laura out. We should speak to Captain Grizzly about it. We spoke to Captain Grizzly, who told us that Laura doesn't have a child. Never did. She also claims Laura is a dangerous pirate who attacked her and her staff. The captain has asked us to kill Laura before she hurts anyone else. We've said we'd think on it. So that's that. Um, and I don't think there's anything else. Uh, a hag survivors. Uh, we dispose of a hag spy named Jatlo. The hag's victims are led by a determined woman, Mayrina. Mayrina told us a suspicion that the very same hag is likely to be found in Baldur's Gate. That her people won't know peace until she's destroyed. Neither of these seem to tell me how to find Laura. The only thing that's still on the map... Well, I'm in the basement, so it's like a bit hard. But it's just the um, investigate the blushing mermaid to save Vanra, which is why I'm here to go through the door. And there's nothing in my journal that tells me about Laura, except for the fact that we initially ran into her at Basilisk Gate and that she wants us dead. But I wasn't going to go talk to Laura until I investigated more. But I assume by asking me about Laura, I should talk to Laura before I continue investigating? Is that how it works? I'm asking overtly, so that's that would be... We have a safe word in here, it's Kit Kat. But normally, for the most part, I try and remember to say Kit Kat, but even if I'm not saying Kit Kat, when I'm paused here and, like, looking, that's... I, I mean to be speaking to you guys overtly about it. Keep talking to the captain. But the captain's not got anything new to say. I literally just spoke to the captain. And she was like, are you going to kill her or not? I'll talk, I'll, I'll talk to her again. But I don't think I need to talk to her again. So will you bring me Laura's head? Or do I have to sleep with one eye open tonight? And I'm not going to say one way or the other what I want to do. Yeah. She claimed her daughter minute that her daughter missed... She claimed her daughter Vanra is missing and that she vanished when the pair were in the Blushing Mermaid. She begged us for help. We remember that. We got that like way early on. Laura's behaving strangely. She pulled a knife on him. The owner of the tavern, Captain Grizzly, had to throw Laura out. We should speak to Captain Grizzly about it. Captain Grizzly told us that Laura doesn't have a child, that she never did. She also claims Laura's a dangerous pirate who attacked her and her staff, which lines up with what the bartender said. Laura's behaving strangely. She pulled a knife on him. Captain has asked us to kill Laura before she hurts anyone else. So the conflict that we have here is Laura who's asked us to help find her child. Her child went been missing. And then the bartender and Grizzly's story line up, which is that Laura, well, the bartender says it's behaving strangely that she pulled the knife, but basically that Laura tried to kill the bartender and the captain. The captain asserts that Laura never had a child. And now the captain wants Laura killed before we do anything. So I would assume Oh, there's obviously something afoot, which is why I was like, let me continue exploring the Blushing Mermaid. But you guys asking me to go speak to Laura's mom makes me think that I need to go, go find out about it first. I don't think you've noticed that you've gotten conflicting stories that point to someone lying. But I think that is the conflict, right? It's either Laura is lying or the bartender and the captain are lying. Or, or is there something else I'm actually missing? Yeah, 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 I'm not going to kill her. I don't plan on killing her. Someone else you spoke to, though.
Who else did I speak to? It's good music. Who else did I speak to today about this? Or is it not someone that I spoke to today about it? You can keep exploring the basement. Let me do this. Let me let me do a hard save. No, no, sorry. Let me do a hard save. Not just this. And I'm just going to go explore the basement. Because that's what I would do organically. I, I feel so bad. I feel like you guys are pointing me to do something and I, I don't understand what you guys are wanting me to do. I feel terrible. So I'm just going to do... um. Before, before mermaid basement. So I'm just gonna do this the way that I would do it by myself, which is, I've got a quest marker on my map that says to ex investigate the blushing mermaid. Let me go do it. And if it cocks things up, then we'll go and we'll, we'll undo it. <sighs> you need to talk to Mayrina. I don't see how Mayrina relates back to this. And so don't tell me, I'll have to figure it out on my own. Maybe I should. <laughs> She's got mi okay. Join the hag survivors. And we read how to get rid of a hag. I've done the hard save before this. Let's just open this. Oh, it just loops back around. There is nothing to explore here. There's literally nothing to explore here. Break this. Sorry. No more wine for people in the Blushing Mermaid. Sorry. Yeah, there's nothing here. I think this is just... Or it doesn't... Uh, for the time being, there's nothing here. I don't know. I don't see anything here. Money, the goblet. All right. Oops, not that. Keep your distance, darling. Okay. Should be easy. Okay. All right. Good stuff. Come on, you know this game by now. There's always something. You never know, sometimes a seller is just a seller. Hag shit. Hag shit. This is some real hag shit. All right. Hag malarkey going on underneath. Underneath the blush, blushing mermaid. All right, all right. Hmm. Always look for secret doors. Yeah, Hag Quest makes you think Larry and Horror Story book game would be so good. Well, and here's a question. Out of pure curiosity. All right. I, I don't have an opinion. I just want to get the... Th I, I, I want to... Are you happy that Larian is not going to be doing more Baldur's Gate stuff? Or does it bum you out? Pacino, how the shit am I supposed to find her? Ah, uh, I see what probably happened. I I went in this. Oh. Oh, I tried them all. None of them are 
Johnson. Sorry, I, I didn't hear it. I didn't hear it. I wasn't expecting them to talk. Anyway, two things. I think this is what happened. I think I was supposed to go to that door that I just unlocked, the Brox, whatever it's called. Um, and I didn't go there because I had accidentally stumbled across them in the other building already. So I'd missed a step in that. Devastated, think the right thing back around from Hasbro. Bums me out, devastated. The conversation, I know, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, all right, well. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Huh? Bas bas mm. I was in the combat log, but I want to hear them have it. I want to hear them. So it's if you walk past that building. Where? Where is, sorry, didn't someone tell me which um, warp point is the closest to use? I, okay, my opinion on on um, them not doing uh, more D&D &D stuff, I kind of feel like, and I'm not finished with it, okay, but I kind of feel like Baldur's Gate 3 is so peak. I, to me, I know that there's whole drama with Hasbro and Wizards of the um, Wizards of the Coast. Yeah, Wizards of the Coast. I know there's a whole drama there, but to me, it kind of feels like Larian's leaving the table high, and I like that. I'm like Baldur's Gate is so fantastic. I don't know if I want another Baldur's Gate. I want to see you create another. I want to see you put in the talent and story building craft that you've done with this and make something else entirely new. So I'm kind of excited that they're not doing another one, but that's that's just me. Warp nine, number one and get, what, CM? Lower city central wall's close to the house. Yeah, lower city central wall, let's just go here. Oh, I've said it earlier, it said earlier, but happy Flarian because it lets them do more things yet that they want to do, but horribly scared for Baldur's Gate 4 because it could go devastating badly in comparison to the masterpiece. I mean, like, I know there has to be a Baldur's Gate 4. Because in my brain, I'm like, you're just not going to have Borders Gate 3 and not do a Borders Gate 4. But I'm kind of like, don't. I'm like, just don't. I'm not... Now, the only thing that's kind of... I, I don't even want to say agitating, because it's not agitating. But the only thing that's kind of... Ah, oh, guessing me about this um, side quest to go find Laura again. How the hell am I supposed to know where to find her? Maybe I should know how to find her already, and I just don't. Upon their return, the cat couldn't help but wonder whether the tall one had finally decided how their die would be cast. Okay, we've been here already. Here we go. Hey, Trudy, how's it going, lovely? What is up here? Central Watchtower? Would you rather be stabbed in the gut or decapitated? Are you unwell? Oh, uh, this is like to get on the, I see. Is there any reason I'd want to be up here? Surely they... They shouldn't let me do this. We have to go check out the chest. When their backs are turned. Hey, Ostrich Breath, Wealth Moon. Lovely, how's it going? Hey, exactly. It's like to see new worlds from Larian. Yeah. Sun speech about the game devs pretty much sums up yeah, his feelings without qu calling out anyone specifically. Oh, they're, they're each going to be looking at it. It's not worth it. Not worth it. Um, Have I been, like, here yet? Hmm. 
Play the Stellar Blade demo. I th I will. I will. I just don't know when. I couldn't do it on Friday. I was planning on doing it on Friday and I couldn't because of work things. So maybe I play it sometime this week. I don't know. I, I reckon it's going to be a whole stream's worth. Well, I don't know. Those of you that have played the demo, how, how long is it? Oh! This is Laura's home. But like, I wouldn't know how to... I. I wouldn't know how to find that. It's not marked on the map. Well, that worked out well. Demo's only an hour. I've heard such conflicting information about it. It's an hour, a couple hours, an overdue reunion. At most, at most a couple hours. So I'm gonna smash through it in just over an hour. Yeah, four of my hours. Oi. Laura, how are you bloody keeping? And myself and the boys will be making a port. We'll be making port in a 10 day. And we thought it high time we all had ourselves a few gargles in the blushing maid. And we ain't taken no for an answer. How's the little one? Bet she's as tall as myself now. My own boy outstripped me last year. They grow up so fast, don't they? I know you're happier in the city, but damned if we don't miss you on the liberty. Boarding civvies ain't the same without quick lip Laura. Yours fearsomely, Tim Two Fingers. All right. She also claims Laura's a dangerous pirate who attacked her and her staff. So it seems Laura is both a retired pirate. Okay, Laura seems, it seems like if we believe the letter that Laura is a retired pirate and that she definitely has a kid. Sounds like Java wrote that letter, hardly. You'll be fine with doing it under two hours. Mm. I mean, there's definite signs that she has a child. We got teddy bears and blocks, ventures of the sea of fallen stars. This is a children's book, I assume, about a pirate. A collection of stories featuring legendary pirates of the Forgotten Realms. A note on the inside cover reads, Lots of love, Uncle Tim Two Fingers. Gracie Graveheart drew her cutlass and pointed at evil Lord Buckler. You men are defeated. Your ship sunk. Free the people of Everwind and I'll spare your pathetic life. Lord Buckler turned red with anger, but he knew he'd been beaten. And so he bowed his head, handing Gracie the key to the secret island of Everwind. The people cheered, crowning Queen Gracie. Whilst Gracie continued to sail the Liberty with her daring crew, they made the Hidden Kingdom home. When Gracie died, her crew honored her last wishes, burying their captain on the island and tossing the key into Umberly's embrace that none may torment ever went the way the evil Lord Buckler once did. Whilst Gracie's long gone, they say you can still see the red sails of the Liberty on the horizon, right as the sun is about to rise. That's beautiful. So smart so smart they don't need to do that like you don't need to to write a children's book story you don't need to come up with your own head canon why sometimes there's a red sky in the morning and shit like that but they did it's just crazy in like a great way you're here does this mean you found my daughter the flaming fish still have no clue useless twats you never told me you pulled a knife on the blushing mermaid or that you used to be a pirate. I'm not proud of my past, all right? I lived a violent life, but that all changed when I had Banra. Getting the occasional drink in the blushing mermaid is as close as I get to the old days. As for pulling a knife, fine, I did. All right. But they wouldn't let me look for Banra and I panicked, all right? Captain Grizzly said you don't have a daughter. Could she say such an awful thing? I, I, I feel like I'm losing my mind. Vanbrook is real, damn it. All I want for her is to be home and safe. Please. I believe her. I think she is the mum. Um, and that the others are um, probably in in including with the hags well one map of the sea of fallen stars a small red x marks spot on ilkithon just off of vilhon reach 
Okay. Night, night, pirate ship. This well thumbed collection of nursery rhymes opens a dog eared page. Umberly remembers. Toss your coin on whispered prayer. Down, down, down. Spare us, sea queen, blessed and fair. Down, down, down. Your depths were dragged with care. Down, down, down. I, that, just, that sounds like a terrible idea. Um, all right, so let's save. Let's go back to the Blushing Mermaid. I assume let's talk to the naughty parties. Uh, oh, actually, it's probably not quicker to fast travel. We'll just walk it. We'll leg it. Uh, hey, Sandra, welcome in. I know, I am so monumentally thrilled, appreciative, all of the above. Um, thank Massive shout out and thank you to all of you who have um, decided to subscribe to the channel, tier one, two, and three. I have a goal to enter the Partner Plus program, so you guys subscribing tier one, two, and three helps push, put me closer towards that goal. I've walked the wrong effing way. Um, and uh, when I started the stream today, we were at 371. Um, so I don't know what we're at now. It kind of updates a bit, like, bizarrely, especially when I'm, like, mm, streaming. But massive shout out and thank you to all you lovely people. Yeah, not gonna lie, watching you investigating this. Oh, it's literally so much fun. Oh, thank God. I thought you guys were gonna be like, you moron, you should have known where Laura is. It's almost like getting to experience everything for the first time again, so thank you so much for that. Hope you're loving everything. You're such a, like, that's such a lovely thing for you to say, Faylight. You're so sweet. I'm massively enjoying the game. It's been such a weird thing where I've been playing this game for over 200 hours. This is still obviously my first playthrough. Um, and I started playing it in November. And you know when you have those games where I don't know if anyone else is like this. You love the game so much that you don't want to finish it. On the one hand, Baldur's Gate is kind of like that for me. I love it so much. I will only ever have one playthrough. I don't want to finish it. But then also at the same time, I'm just, it's like, I, I don't, I don't even see how I could possibly finish it. There's so much, there's so much. And then I am also kind of looking forward to finishing it so I can get through on another playthrough or finally be able to look at content without being concerned or you know all that lovely stuff if you're here to complain that the booze tastes like piss i know anything else oh no let's maybe just go talk to the captain instead i'm like are you hung over or is there something else so will you bring me laura's head or do I have to sleep with one eye open tonight? Okay, I'm being daft. I've just spoken with Laura. Am I not able to confront the captain about this information? Is there something else I should be doing? Or should I just go down into the basement? Is it going to be dirty? It's going to be resist dirty. You're not alone, Java. Are you literally saying right now? So I'm finished even though I'm planning another playthrough. It's so, isn't that just so odd? In like the best way possible, because I'm the exact same. Yeah, I keep restarting the end of act one because I think subconsciously ending the game would be sad, totally. You can keep talking to the captain. Oh, just refuse to kill Laura. So will you bring me Laura's head? Or do I have to sleep Sorry. with one eye open tonight? I was like, bye. Oh, you're no fun. <laughs> I wanted you to stain your soul with the blood of an innocent mother. Oh, well, guess I'll just decorate the room with your insides. They'll match my new carpet beautifully. I wish I'd close the door. Hello, Petal. Miss me? She's so great. I, I killed you? <laughs> ha! The 
Did you think you were the first? That I didn't plan for it, Petal? Marina ran off with the child I was promised. Because of you. So I had to find myself a new one. And little Vanra was so very tasty. It can't be true. You're lying. Look at her stomach. <gasps> oh no. She did have a full stomach. I'm already showing. Doesn't it suit me so well? Venra sits in my belly, growing fat with power. In time, I'll vomit her up and have myself a fresh young hag to train. Unfortunately, that leaves me in a pickle. For a while, I'd love to rip your guts out. I shouldn't. Exertion is bad for the baby, you know. So, walk away. Walk away and let me a fine hag make. Okay, bye-bye. We're going. Uh, obviously not. Surrender the child immediately. Uh, what? A star unit approved. You kill me? Touch me, and the girl dies. And I'll simply return. Stronger than ever. <laughs> A woman in my condition should be relaxing in the bath, not dealing with this nonsense. I'll leave you to my crew, matey. And should you somehow survive, stay away. Our van will suffer. Okay. It's actually not that bad. Kind of. Uh, hey, welcome back. Oh no, the red caps, I know. Bollocks. She's gone and scarpered. Yeah, we're just left with these guys. Um. Silas Silvertongue. I don't think it works like that. The subtle yeah. I don't know why I did that. Don't, don't, don't ask me. I don't know. It, it was stupid. But can I get... Like, if Gale were to move closer? Okay. Can I have him now? Okay. Yes. But I still walk up to him. Interesting. Can I even reach this guy? I can't attack that guy without provoking an attack opportunity. But are you gonna attack opportunity me through Gale? No. Blood follows me everywhere. How? Okay, great. <laughs> Ipsy pipsies. 
the the thing that sucks is that you see them dodge before you even see the missed text box and it's like i know that i missed thank you very much uh i can't move him i don't fancy their chances um lightning bolts and now i can't move him without oh no i can move him still don't get too close okay great wait hang on chain ah uh, chain lightning strike an enemy with lightning three more bolts will leap from the target and trying as many as three other enemies within 18 meters so if i to do that hopefully then it attacks the others oh nice okay all right all right all right all right It's fine. Well, I mean, what else would I... He's fine. Such I want them. <laughs> You're sweeter than rum. Uh... Okay. Spirit Guardians, I love Spirit Guardians. Are you resistant to anything? Ethel's Twisted Blessing. As one of Ethel's loyal servants, this Red Caps has additional 40 hit points and their strength. Constitution towards increased. I think it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We'll be fine. Do I even want to use a healing spell on me? No, I think I'm just going to do this. Sure, yep. Great. Okay. Spiritual weapon. High defense. Provokes the attack. Yeah, whatever. I, I cocked it up. Yeah. Gonna bleed. Make all the holes. Leave me alone. Great. Um. It will provoke an attack opportunity course ghouls i'm kind of grown attached to these guys now to be honest and then Maybe we just do a little offhand jab. Sure. Okay. And that from here. I will jump crushing flight onto these two here. Amazing. Okay, 71. Let's get rid of this one. Fantastic. Cool, and that. I do like chain lightning. No, chain. Oh, it's a level six spell. <laughs> no wonder I like it. <laughs> I really like this incredibly powerful spell that I have. Um. Target cannot use reaction spells advantage. Call for the uh, Yeah, it's in a line of intro Yeah, I've cocked this up. Um, I could conjure an elemental. Cone of cold, ray of frost. Uh, shatter, damages all nearby creatures and objects, creatures. Bone chill, blight. Maybe let's just do blight. Yeah, why not? Terrible. That's why not. Um, just shove him. 
Great. Terrible. Shouldn't the ghoul be attacking? Yes. Terrible, 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 atrocious. I need healing. Hello. Mm. Attack an enemy as a reaction if they cast a spell near me. Yes. Great, okay. Great. Oh dear. Um yeah. Yeah. Great. Okay. Oh for fuck's sake. Great. Um Can't reach the destination. Maybe I just handle it. That was stupid. I don't know why I did that. But now I'm committed. I don't know, dude. I don't know why I did that. It would be nice if I could help her up. That did nothing. Uh, I'm just gonna leave it. Fuck it. I can't stay idle. I don't know. I don't know. I'm making a dog's dinner of it. It's fine. Don't worry about it, guys. It's all right. Great. That guy has to be dead. Fantastic. Cool. Not enough movement. Uh, let's just waddle as far as we can. Yep. Yep. Okay, end it here. Great. Terrible. Are you joking? Um... Bone chill, shatter. That's, yeah, that's in like an AOE type thing. Can I actually do shatter like, no, it's gonna get the ghoul in it, but I might, I might be actually be okay. No, cause it'll get me in it as well. Okay, can I get a better, no. Um. That's fine. Okay. Whatever. I I'm I'm making such a dog's dinner of this. I don't know. Yep, I've done this terribly. Yes, yes, go, 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 ghoul. Yeah, I should go help. Okay, we might be able to take this guy out quick enough. Hang on, concentration on the bloodlust. Kill him, the bloodlust ends. Great. Okay, cool. And that. Terrible. Okay. Help her. And then he's got 38 points. I have a big healing, don't I? Great. No, I've got a bigger, bigger. Yeah. Ah, uh, that was probably dramatic. I didn't need all that. Never a dull moment. Okay, those two are dead. Yup, yup, yup. It's just that one there. So maybe we just do crushing flight. Like that. Oh my god, he didn't go prone. 
That never happens. Okay, so it's just that one there. I don't know if I can make it though. No, I definitely can't. So I'll just move a bit further forwards. We'll call it a day. Are you joking? Come on! I mean, this is this is pathetic at this point. Uh, can I even thread the needle here? Ray of Frost is going to damage other people, I think. Bone Chill, I would have to touch him. All right. <laughs> Why not? Go, go for enter the fray, Gale. Oh no, I don't have to touch him. Fantastic. You can take another little baby potion. Shadow Heart. Uh. We'll just jump away. <laughs> nice. So worthwhile. Great. What? Yeah, we're gonna have to end that. How much HP? This guy's 14 HP. Main hand attack? Off hand attack. Off hand attack. Great. Goodbye, ghouls. I've loved having you here. That was so messy. I did that so messy. I know that. It's almost like keeping Shadowheart as AC 30 makes it easy to hit in level 12 combat. I don't know what you're talking about, Callie. I don't know why you would think that this armor would make Shadowheart easy to hit and take down. I don't know why you would even think to suggest that this armor doesn't protect her. How could this, how could she not survive damage in this armor? It's crazy. This clearly protects her most vulnerable parts very, very well. She should have no problem standing up against combat like this. It's very realistic and very protective. Exactly. I can't believe you would, you could possibly suggest that this would remotely be the issue. Why? It's definitely not because I've got her in barely any clothes. It's, it's clearly because she's a terrible fighter. At least give her a shield. Wait, I can't give her a, sh I can't give her a shield. Why doesn't she have a shield? Wait, why doesn't she have a shield? Who, what shield do you have? Didn't she used to carry this? Why isn't she carrying that? Did I give that to someone else? I swear, hang on, hang on, hang on. Jokes aside, I swear I had her carrying the shield for an, for a while. Oh, does it cause it covers her bum? No. Why did I not have her have the shield? I probably unequipped it at some point without realizing. I must have done. Or am I just being daft and did I never have her in a shield to begin with? The spear is two-handed. I feel like that must be it, but it lets me equip a shield here. You know what I feel like might have happened I feel like what might have happened is that when I got this spear we were having the sort of debate that we're having now about whether or not it needs to be two-handed um it, it, whether it needs to be two-handed or single-handed and so I think I was like oh okay I'll just have her single uh sorry I'll have her two-handed I I think that's probably what happened but I do think it's more valuable instead to have her have a shield because I don't want to take the clothes off. Because the clothes obviously look great. Maggoty Jim. <gasps> Whispering Mask. Uh, Bert the Weasel Adams. Whispering Mask. Two-tone Reacher. 
Ethel's chest key. And more. We got a whole bunch of masks. Empty, 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 empty. Ribald shanties for discerning horse on. A collection of bawdy tavern songs, each one more grim, grimed in filth and innuendo than the last. One of them, birthday on the bill, bill drat, is such a horrifying material that any decent person would burn this book right now. The cleanest verse is, <coughs> the first mate's cock stood like the mast, hard and veiny as a marble handle. And when the fair lass bent to him, she soon blew out his birthday candle. Um, I think we're going to end stream here for today. <laughs> there is simply no surpassing that. There is also simply no possible other way to to do that better than we've done it before. Um, so I reckon we'll probably just wrap up here. And in the, in the next part, we'll finish whatever's going on with the hag. And, uh, and um, finally do Cazador. I really actually genuinely want to do Cazador because we've not done that for bloody ages. I mean, days, Louise, yeah. <laughs>